pages I will be distributing about things that are going on. I will not, I will not go on and on about it, but I hope you read the article in the paper about the homeless people under the bridge. That is one of the best pieces we have had done uh, that really, I think, gives people an idea of why people are homeless, how that happens, and in whatever organization you serve, I hope that you are aware of all of that because those folks, you know, have various and sundry things that people can help with if someone knew, and now they know. So I would encourage you to be involved with the various and sundry things that are happening over Christmas. I know there's going to be a big Christmas dinner. There'll be other organizations. Please keep an eye out for that because we are, you know, having tremendous things of need in this area. As you know, the um, 100 black men served a thousand people at Thanksgiving. Not just people who were living under the bridge, people who were living in abandoned houses, people that are in dire circumstances because they do not have jobs or transportation to get to their jobs, or they have, when the gentleman was talking about needing his teeth and just assuming that he's gonna have to have them pulled and eat soup, you know, there's a place in Albany that for about $300 can give him dentures all in one day. And, you know, if someone would step up and do that, that would make a huge difference in his getting a job because if you walk into a place of business and your teeth are all gone, that is not who people want to hire and put out in front of the public. But that stuff is available. Information like that is out there if someone will get it to them. Uh,